Hi guys, hope you're doing well today. Um, I decided to come on today. I promise you guys I'll come up with another video within this week. So um, before we even get into everything, hope you guys are all doing well. And I just want to come on and let you guys know about the stuff that I found. I think that would be ideal for young ladies, little girls, just for stocking stuffers. So this may be a long video, so please forgive me. Before we get into this video, I just need to get something off my chest. Things that have been going on on YouTube, which is very disturbing. Number one, Gabby Hanna. Totally unacceptable. I know, everybody knows that Trisha Paytas is a troll on YouTube or wherever it is. I've even heard people say that they feel like they basically know her vagina more than they know her. But that's just what's been said about her. But the sad thing is, and it's which is totally unacceptable, is for Gabby Hanna to put such wrong information out there about Trisha Paytas. That's something you do not do. Apparently, this was done years ago, and I did watch Gabby Hanna's video on her Instagram video. For number one, if your life is so full and you're so happy with your life, why are you sitting on your phone, on Instagram, and you need to run all this by strangers? Strangers. I'm going to call them strangers because that's what they are. You said you have three good friends in your life. You have a boyfriend. You're happy. You Whatever you said. So why aren't you running it through these three friends? Don't go on Instagram and put other people's business out there. Especially wrong information. Which is very wrong. And to top things off. Um, this other YouTuber came forward. Miss Smiles. I hope that's her name. And you know. I'm happy for what she did, but I just sat there and I broke down because nobody should really love the hardships that they've been through. And at the end of the day, Gabby Hannah needs to let it go and she needs to just go away as far as I'm concerned. Because clearly, in my opinion, she's looking for attention. She's seeking attention in the wrong places and it's going to hurt her in some way or form because that is something you do not do who holds on to text messages for like five years a manipulative person a person that wants to come back and have information on the next person that is a sick person as far as i'm concerned point blank period end of story whatever you want to say you can get the full story on um dustin daly's channel he does it so eloquently he I just love that guy because, you know, being a drama channel, he doesn't demonize people or make them look bad or the way he even speaks. I, it speaks volumes for me. I truly, truly enjoy watching him. So I'm going to leave his um, YouTube channel below. Go ahead. And he has a full story on this pathetic person Gabby Hanna that's all I can say she is pathetic the next thing I want to talk about is and everybody's been talking about it and I did get I didn't go on because I don't feel I'm gonna give a little kid all the notoriety which her mother is totally in my opinion 100% exploiting this child and I'm talking about Daniel Kahn Spoolfish another drama channel has the whole story but in a little bit of what is going on is that they were on vacation in Hawaii and this kid has on and let's emphasize even Google has in my opinion now finalized she is 13 years old so while vacationing in Hawaii her mother tells her to pose in this bikini and show them that everything is real and not fake What the hell? Is this woman normal? Who in this? This is totally me, and the, this is the way I see it. Who puts your child in harm's way? Aren't we as parents supposed to protect our kids? 
my kids i have girls 19 14 and 17. they'll be lucky if they can even get out the door in tights or leggings without something covering their backside and there's this woman exploiting a child and telling a child to show off all her assets and to show the people that she doesn't photoshop anything or everything or her body parts are real what the hell that is absolutely disgusting and she'd be ashamed to call herself a mother as far as i'm concerned if you guys want to hear that full story i'm gonna link um spill sessions channel down below and you can watch the full thing but that is absolutely disgusting for a 13 year old for a mother to be exploiting a 13 year old get off your backside and go get a job and you support your children don't let your children support you you are absolutely Oh, I don't even have a, a decent word for that woman. But anyway, on a light note, I just had to get that out there. On a light note, you guys, I went into um, Alta and I mean, I've been going a few places. And for most of the time, what I do is normally I pick things up from maybe a dollar store or Walmart or stuff like that. But I went into Alta and this is all the dollar deals that I found, which I think is perfect for the little girls up to, I'll say, about 10 years old. So the first thing we have is the Sweet and Shimmer Nail Polish Remover Pads. There's 32 in here. How cute is that? It's, it's, it's cute, but a stocking stuffer. Then we have the Sweet and Shimmer Merry Mint Scented Wipes. There's 15 in a pack. And as I say, you guys, these are like... A dollar we have these bobby pins there's 24 in here that is absolutely cute and I, I, i'm liking the color then we have the sweet and shimmer lip gloss and these actually are five for five dollars but if you buy them separately they're like 2.99 and then we have the merriment and this seems to all be a theme with the same make uh, sweet and shimmer this is their lip scrub i mean i haven't tried it my daughter's tried it and she said she she likes it and we have this hand lotion and this is like good size you guys this is perfect for a stocking stuffer well clearly my nine-year-old friends this, this is exactly what they're getting five bucks and i'm good <laughs> then we have the tweezers how cute is that I mean, a uh, little girl doesn't need a tweezer. But then they do have these compact mirrors, which is so adorable. Look how cute this is. That is so cute. This, my daughter's already opened that one. And then we have a bath and shower fizzer. And, oh, this is adorable. This is bubble bath. I'm actually going to pick up quite a few of these because I think this is cute. Uh, if you want to make like baskets for um, the end of the year for teachers, put that in with a few other things. Then we have the Sweet and Shimmer Eyeshadow Palette. These are absolutely adorable for little girls that you know just playing around with makeup and stuff like that you guys i'm not going to open this because of the mere fact is that all these deals that i'm going to do i'm actually going to combine it at the end maybe probably around about beginning of december i'm just going to box it up i'm going to have a giveaway and whatever's like whatever i show you guys i'm actually going to put in the giveaway and then somebody can you know Give it to the kid or what? This is the blush set. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. That is absolutely adorable. Then you guys, I went on like, oh no, one more thing. This is the chapstick. This is in the berry, berry, belly. Oh wow, what a weird name. That's the chapstick. And yeah, that's about it for the dollar deals, you guys. And that's why it's not bad at all. I mean, they went, I got this, I think the second time around, they were like close to empty. So that's when it struck me. You know what? Let me do this. And I want to do it now because 
before they run out. So I did go online and I found these amazing deals. I bought all these lip pencils. It's Essence Lip Pencils, which are only a dollar thirty-five. This is not good, you guys. A dollar thirty-five. Okay, I'm just gonna swatch this one. The other ones I'm not gonna swatch because, as I said to you guys, I want to put it all, you know, like in a big giveaway box, or maybe I'll just. Um... This is very nice. Can you see it? I'll have to keep this one aside. Um, and how many did I get? What color was that? And this is by Essence, mind you. I can't even see the color. Why is the writing so small? But anyway, I've got basically, I actually bought all the colors. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine. So I just used the one and then I'm going to put the rest in a box. And I'll actually do, I don't know, I'll do a giveaway with all this. I mean, I'm sure somebody will appreciate it. And then next what we have is, look at these lip glosses, you guys. This is the lip pencils and the lip gloss on Alta.com is $1.35. Um, let me actually check and see if they still have it. Okay, you guys, I went online and I did check and now they're $2.99 each. But it's buy one, get one 50% off. I can definitely say that I did pay. I actually threw my receipts away, but I can check on my um, Alta account that I'm sure I paid a dollar something. It wasn't more than a dollar fifty each. So these are very, very nice. I actually got all nine colors. This one is in the Friends of Glamour. And then we just have the plain, the gloss. And for a night out. And then we have Bright on. Then we have happiness. Oh, happiness in a bottle. And you get the point. I actually got nine of them. So I'm actually going to just put this away. And for, as I said, for that giveaway. And then we have these face masks. This is the peel of clay mask, sweet tea and lemon. These were a dollar. Uh, literally a dollar. I didn't buy more of these because of the mere fact that I've never tried it. I actually asked my daughter. She said that she did try it, but I prefer to try it myself because I'm actually putting these in the giveaway. So I don't want to just buy something. And then if I feel that it's, you know, you can use it at your own, there's no problem. But this is the detoxifying charcoal and black sugar mud mask. As I said, these were a dollar, and this is not bad at all for stocking stuffers. Okay, before I go on, I said to you, I just want to do the um, dollar stocking stuffers. But this is something I just picked up yesterday at uh, Marshall's, and I don't know how much longer it's going to last. because, And I'm sure they always have it there, but you know what, if it thing. What I did also pick up from Alta.com was these um, these highlighters from Colourpop. And I literally paid $3.50 for two. And I don't like these singles, so that's definitely going in that box. Yeah, so as I was saying, I went to um, Marshalls and I picked up all these palettes which were on sale. Not, none of these palettes were over $4. So we've got this. Namaste in India eyeshadow palette, which is, it does have very, very nice colors in it. And I'm sure you guys must have all seen these by now because I'm very late in the game. That is such pretty colors. So we got that one. And then Color Story Modern Rose eyeshadow palette. This was $4. Literally four dollars, and 
you guys how pretty is that i mean totally neutral colors i've picked up three i'm talking about three and i was just looking at these the other day at um alter this, this makeup revolution because one thing i was keeping my eye on was for the Patricia Bright, the collab she did with uh, Makeup Revolution. It looks so interesting. I just want to see, guys, I didn't even open it. This was $5.99. So we're going to see what this is all about. You guys, you know I am just a damn sucker for packaging. Honestly, I am. I wish you could see what my room looks like. Oh my gosh. My husband was just home and he was like, oh no, we need to do something here. So, my goodness, these people seal things so much. It's, this is ridiculous. Well, there goes the packaging. Because I don't have time for all this. Are you kidding me? I'm wrapping the box. Too bad. I'm sure you guys must have seen this by now, but, but for this price, it's like, wow. Ooh. Oh, that's cute. I'm bummed that I actually tore the packaging. I could have put this in a giveaway. Let's see if this one, let's see if we can get to this one. This one here was $5. You gotta be kidding me. There we go. Can you please go and open this for me, please, my baby? Yes. Then we did, I did find the Makeup Revolution Pro HD Amplified 35 palettes. <laughs> this one was five bucks. Isn't that cute? I think this is a bit bigger than what? Look at you. The way they... Was it just me? Oh, they look the same. That looks like the baby version of that, doesn't it? That is so cute. I think my daughter already has this one. I think I did buy it for already. I'm bummed that I brought, I didn't open the packaging. I really want to give, put this in the giveaway. Okay. We got that. Did you get it open, girl? You guys, I've never ever heard of this brand. Can you let me know? It's like, I, oh, I imagine, 35 eyeshadow palettes. Let's see what this is about. Why do people seal the packaging like this, you guys? This was also five bucks. Ooh. That's such a... Isn't that so nice? Oh, these are also neutrals. So pretty. How pretty that is. The names are so interesting. My Muse, Naked Truth, Cross the Line, Truth Be Told, Lost Pearl, Twilight Zone, Ballerine, Ballerina Box, Peachy Magic. Oh, that's, that's favorite. Oh my God, you guys, this is so soft and buttery. Oh, wow. This is phenomenal. Can you guys see that? I'll try this black. How is that even black? Yeah, no, nothing there. Nothing coming up there. I mean, it's it feels nice. Oh, yeah, give me a wig, please, girl. Okay, okay, we got that one. Did she open this one? There's this. That is the. The Flawless Matte 2. 
That was really pretty. Anyway, I mean, at the end of the guy, at the end of the day, you guys, these if you're gonna just use as stocking stuffers, there is absolutely nothing wrong with that, and especially for the mere fact if you know your daughter is just starting out or you know just play around, because that's exactly what my girls would all they do is just play around with all this. So that's it. What else do I get from? I think that was the only thing that I got from um, Marshalls, if I'm not mistaken. Then, that same day that I went into the store for the dollar deals, they had their sale on the Morphe palettes. The 35V, excuse me, and uh, the 35M, which was $15. But then after the um, the coupon for $3.50 or $15, with tax, it came to $13.50 which I thought was a phenomenal deal. Then today I went onto the Morphe um, website and they have in their palettes for $18. And I think I think I did get the, the one blue one, but I must double check. So this is the 35V Morphe palettes. There you go. This is this is awesome. For $13.50, you guys, this is absolutely beautiful. And it feels so nice. See purple. Look at that. You cannot go wrong with Morphe. Absolutely not. So I got that one. And then what did I do? I've got the 35M boss mode. This is also this is very nice. Those are quite colourful. And the last thing that I did pick up was, I don't know. I'm um, actually, this is the NYX, what did it say? The NYX Professional Makeup Wonder Stick Highlight and Contour Stick. You guys, this was $2.25. $2.25 for a NYX product. Oh my gosh. This is in the medium tan. I'm not going to lie to myself. I'm never going to use this. So I'm actually going to put it in the giveaway. And yeah, so that's about it, you guys, for the um, the dollar stocking stuffers. And I think this was definitely, definitely a hit, you know, for those little girls that run to their, that love makeup. And who's a little girl doesn't love makeup? So that's definitely a good deal. So by Friday, I'm actually, no. On Friday, I'm actually gonna do my um, Black Friday shopping list where I have found awesome deals, absolutely awesome deals on mainly electronics. But for the most part, I will be looking at other things and I'm gonna show you guys where's the cheapest place for everything if that helps out that's fine but that's definitely what I want to do I hope this you guys helps you out a bit I know it helps me out with my little one and her friends so at the end of the day for the two friends that I do buy these I know their stocking stuffers are covered <laughs> I don't have to stress about that but for the most part, I think that's about it. And as I said, you guys, every time I do this, the next time it would be, I think it will be next Monday, I'm going to do the $5 deals. And if you guys would like me to um, show you other things, one thing I do want to do, and let's not forget about the little boys. We, I've got to find little stocking stuffers for them, which I know I can get.
but I just want to get more of it so they can, you know, you can have a choice of, of what you can put in their stocking stuffers. I know I have a hard time with my son because he is just a gaming fanatic. So I'm basically just stuck, just gift cards, games, and that's it. He doesn't want anything else. Two years in a row, we've bought him, um, the year before last, we bought him this expensive um, remote control car or truck, whatever. It's still sitting in my storage room in, my, in the, the hallway. Last year, we bought him a drone. That is sitting in my attic. Never ever touch. This child is just like a gamer through and through. That's all he wants. He wants games, he wants uh, consoles, and that must make things work. You guys, I hope this helped you out. And if you like videos like this, just let me know. Let me know what you want to see. And um, don't forget like, subscribe, share, ring the notification, all that jazz. I know you're. I'm sick of it. I don't think much. You know, you know the deal. You gotta, you gotta say it. So with that all out of the way, I hope this helped out. As I said, I'm gonna just include everything in a giveaway, maybe two giveaways, in regard to this. And um, by the time we get to the end of all this, we'll discuss. There is no damn rules. All you gotta do is you know the whole procedure. Subscribe, like, comment, all that. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget before you leave, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time I upload. And stay warm out there, you guys. Please, as I always say, please be kind to one another. It doesn't take you a penny just to put a smile on somebody else's face by just sending them a smile in their direction. So thank you so much, you guys, for watching. I appreciate your time so much and have a great rest of your week. I'll see you on Friday. Bye, guys.